Join us aboard our 1969 Ericsson 41 Alma to experience our sailing journey up north. We've been cruising full time on our sailboat Alma, departing from Florida and sailing our way north. Cruising the east coast of the US has been quite the adventure. Now that we've made it to Deltaville, Virginia, we feel relieved and thankful to be in such a great anchorage. But the journey of how we got here is just as important. It doesn't matter how slow you go, as long as you keep going. We learned this through our sailboat's refit and sailing up north. As soon as you try to rush, that's when things go wrong. It's better to give yourself enough time. That way you can enjoy the journey more. Whenever we can, we put our sails up, letting our sailboat, who was designed for racing, do what she does best. We've managed to do this part of the trip through the ICW, even with a six foot keel. Oh, you look at the mess inside. I know, it's such a mess. Just inside cooking some nice dinner. And we're gonna enjoy the sunset. A good anchorage for us means good holding and protection. The view is always a bonus. The glory of living on the boat. Uh, both ones just came in and uh, got a glass on the boom or chain. Uh, it was blowing for like 40 minutes. We don't care now. It's only about a few parts. So. Yeah. I'm not done and everything. It's just a little bit awesome. But just in case. 
Good morning. We just woke up. We're gonna make some coffee. It's about 5, 5.30 in the morning. Living on a sailboat, you are very aware of the weather. Last night was a cold front blowing over 40 knots, making today a chilly but beautiful day. We're grateful that there's no rain to continue on our journey. The Chesapeake Bay is an area known for sailing, and we understand why. It feels like you are sailing in the ocean, but with less swell. Being able to sail an average of 7.5 knots, we were able to make it to our destination quicker than we thought, allowing us to be in a wonderful anchorage near great facilities and wonderful people. Deltaville's history was shaped by these waterways. Naming the town the boating capital of the Chesapeake Bay. With only about five to 800 full-time residents during the winter, rising to a population of a couple thousand during the summer, this small town still has all of the essentials for boaters like us. As the sun sets, we head to the bow of the boat a tradition we formed when arriving to a new place. The journey here was slow, but so quick at the same time. We may not have gone where we intended to go, but we ended up where we needed to be. Being happy doesn't mean everything is perfect. It means you decided to look beyond the imperfections. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to give us a like and subscribe if you haven't already. It's a fast and free way to help us out. Today is a special day. Happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. Mother and child, it's a special bond that spans the years through laughter, worry, smiles, and tears. A sense of trust that can't be broken, a depth of love sometimes unspoken, a lifelong friendship built on sharing, hugs and kisses, warmth and caring. Mother and child, their hearts as one, a link that can never be undone. Feel free to share this with a special mom out there. We want to give a shout out to our newest patrons, Mark, Bill, Cyprian, and Miley from SV Tempest. Thank you so much for your support. If you want to join our sailing family and further support our journey and help improve the quality of these videos, check out the link below. With as little as $2 a month, you can have access to neat rewards. Every bit goes a long way.